Right now at 10, a Tulsa police officer accused of going rogue. Tonight, two news with the story of Officer Tyrone Jenkins and his alleged dealings inside the dangerous world of drug trafficking. Good evening, I'm Karen Larson. I'm Max Resnick. The story was breaking just as we went on the air at 5. And in the last few hours, two news uncovered new information. That's right. Two news reporter Joe Hankey live now at the Riverside Division with a detailed look at those fresh developments for us. Joe? The booking report for Tyrone Jenkins' arrest presents his suspected criminal activity with drugs and stolen cash beginning this past February. According to the report, a confidential informant contacted Jenkins in February, letting him know of a large sum of money missed by TPD during a search. The report claims he used a law enforcement database to gain sensitive information for the informant, including tag numbers to locate the money. The report moves on, detailing a meeting in March. The informant met Jenkins and handed him $2,300 from the pile of cash. On Monday, Jenkins met the informant again. The informant showed up with $800 and more than 34 grams of cocaine. The report details Jenkins taking the $800, then making a phone call for the informant about selling the cocaine. The police report claims Jenkins carried a Glock 22 during the meeting. At 1 this afternoon, police arrested Jenkins at the address of the Riverview Park Apartments on South Jackson Avenue in Tulsa. Shortly after, Jenkins found himself in the Tulsa County Jail on charges of conspiracy to traffic cocaine, possession of a firearm while committing a felony, and violation of the Computer Crimes Act. Jenkins found himself booked and held on $36,000 bond. He's a Tulsa police officer at the department's Riverside Division behind me, but earlier today, Tyrone Jenkins found himself being arrested. It's all detailed in this booking report, including the three charges he's now facing.